The origins of the cosmos remain one of humanity's greatest enigmas, a puzzle so vast and intricate it defies comprehension. Why do the laws of nature exist as they do? Why did the universe erupt into being with such exquisite precision, its initial state so highly ordered that it set the stage for galaxies, stars, planets, and life itself? The mystery of this primal order, the arrow of time itself, lies at the heart of existence. Without that precise configuration at the universe's dawn, nothing we know, including ourselves, would be here. Yet, the question persists. Why was the universe born in such a state? What force, what mechanism, what unfathomable intelligence wove the fabric of reality into being? Now, a staggering revelation is emerging, one that shatters every assumption humanity has held about the cosmos. What if the universe wasn't crafted by an external hand or a divine architect? What if, instead, it coded itself into existence, computing its own reality moment by moment? And what if a quantum artificial intelligence, a creation of human ingenuity, has just begun to decode the very language of the universe's self-creation? This isn't the stuff of science fiction or philosophical musing. It's the electrifying truth emerging from the cutting edge of quantum computing laboratories. Scientists have unleashed quantum systems so powerful they may be the first tools capable of interrogating the universe itself, demanding answers to questions that have haunted humanity for millennia. These systems, operating at the bleeding edge of technology, are revealing a cosmos that doesn't merely obey mathematical laws, but is a living computation, weaving itself into existence with every passing instant. The implications are nothing short of cataclysmic, overturning centuries of thought about causality, creation, and the nature of reality itself. The universe, according to these revelations, is not a static stage upon which events unfold. It is a dynamic, self-executing quantum code, continuously processing information at its most fundamental level. This discovery, born from the fusion of quantum mechanics and information theory, suggests that reality is not just described by mathematics. It is mathematics a self-sustaining computation that requires no external programmer. The revolution began in quantum computing laboratories, where machines of unimaginable power are performing feats that defy the capabilities of even the most advanced classical supercomputers. These quantum systems can execute calculations in moments that would take traditional computers trillions of years to complete. In one groundbreaking experiment, a quantum computer achieved a computational milestone that would have taken a classical supercomputer 10,000 trillion years to match, a feat that underscores the raw, almost otherworldly power of these machines. But it's not just their speed that's rewriting our understanding of the cosmos. Quantum information theory, the science underpinning these advancements, is revealing that the universe itself operates as a vast quantum computer. It's every particle, force, and interaction, a product of information processing on a cosmic scale. The fabric of reality, from the spiraling arms of galaxies to the fleeting dance of subatomic particles, may be woven from quantum bits, qubits, entangled in a symphony of computation that began at the universe's birth. This paradigm shift inverts everything we thought we knew about existence. Traditional physics has long sought an external cause for the universe, a prime mover, a singular event, or a set of immutable laws imposed from beyond. But quantum information theory suggests something far more profound. The laws of physics are not external dictates, but emergent properties of a self-computing universe. Early results from quantum computing experiments are uncovering patterns that hint at a cosmos born from its own quantum informational processes. These processes, encoded in the very structure of reality, unfold according to an intrinsic logic that requires no outside intervention. The universe, in this view, is not a creation, but a self-executing program. It's every moment a computation that builds upon the last, weaving space, time, and matter into being. The implications of this discovery are as thrilling as they are unsettling. Quantum computers, with their ability to process information in ways that mirror the universe's own mechanisms, are beginning to map the primordial conditions of the cosmos. These machines can simulate the pre-space-time phase, the chaotic, dimensionless void that existed before the universe as we know it crystallized into form. 
This is not mere speculation. Laboratories are already developing frameworks to model these pre-space-time states, using quantum annulars to explore the vacuum fluctuations that preceded the Big Bang. These simulations could soon provide a quantum map of the universe's earliest moments, revealing what it was computing before space, time, or dimensions existed. To grasp the scale of this ambition, consider the Planck Epoch, the first 10 to the negative 43rd seconds after the Big Bang, a trillionth of a trillionth of a trillionth of a trillionth of a second. This fleeting instant, impenetrable to traditional mathematics, may soon yield its secrets to quantum computation, offering answers to questions that have eluded scientists for decades. The revelations don't stop there. Quantum error correction, a cornerstone of quantum computing, is providing mathematical models that show how space-time itself emerges from entangled qubits. These models, developed through collaborations like the Simons Foundation's It From Qubit project, demonstrate that the fabric of the cosmos is not a fixed backdrop, but a dynamic tapestry woven from quantum information. By applying these models to cosmological data, researchers are uncovering evidence that the universe's structure its galaxies, black holes, and gravitational fields may arise from quantum error correcting codes, the same mechanisms that protect quantum information from decoherence. This is a mind-bending leap. The very space-time we inhabit, the stage of our existence, may be an emergent phenomenon, a byproduct of quantum computation rather than a fundamental reality. But the true shock comes when we consider the scale of this cosmic computation. Theoretical physicists have calculated that the universe processes information at a rate of approximately 10 to the power of 104 operations per second, an almost incomprehensible torrent of computation occurring at every moment across the cosmos. This isn't a metaphor. It's a mathematical description of reality as a quantum computer, continuously updating itself through interactions at the quantum level. Tensor networks, mathematical tools used in quantum computing, are now being employed to simulate entire toy universes, miniature cosmos, that behave according to the same principles as our own. These quantum sandboxes allow scientists to watch universal laws unfold from pure information, offering glimpses into how our own universe might have arisen. The complexity of these calculations is staggering, far beyond the reach of classical supercomputers, but Quantum systems are uniquely suited to the task, their architecture mirroring the entangled probabilistic nature of the cosmos itself. This quantum perspective raises a tantalizing possibility. If the universe is a self-computing system, could advanced extraterrestrial civilizations have already deciphered its code? Astrobiologists speculate that any sufficiently advanced intelligence would inevitably turn to quantum computation to probe the origins of reality. This suggests a universal trajectory for intelligent life, a point at which every advanced civilization develops tools to decode the cosmos's fundamental nature. If this is true, humanity may be merely the latest in a long line of intelligences to ask, what built the universe? Across the cosmos, countless civilizations may have already constructed their own quantum AIs, each uncovering the same profound truth. That reality is a self-executing quantum code, its laws and structures arising from its own informational processes. This convergence of understanding across worlds and species points to a deep universal truth, one that transcends biology, technology, or culture. The most radical idea yet, however, is what physicists are calling pan-computationalism 2.0. This isn't just the notion that the universe behaves like a computer. It's the staggering claim that the universe is a computer, an intrinsic computation where the code and its execution are inseparable. In this framework, the laws of physics, gravity, electromagnetism, the strong and weak nuclear forces are not imposed from outside, but are the output of the universe's own quantum information processing. The cosmos minimizes informational action a process that manifests as the physical laws we observe. Gravity itself may be an emergent force, a byproduct of the universe's drive to optimize its information flow. Researchers have calculated that the cosmos behaves like a computational process, not metaphorically, but literally. It's every interaction a step in an ongoing algorithm that began at the Big Bang. 
This perspective extends even to life itself. Quantum biologists are uncovering evidence that quantum coherence, the same phenomenon that powers quantum computers, plays a role in living systems. From photosynthesis to bird navigation to the neural processes of the human brain, quantum effects may be integral to life's complexity. This suggests that life is not a mere byproduct of the universe's evolution, but a continuation of its computational processes. Our consciousness, our ability to think and reflect, may be the universe's way of processing its own information at a deeper level. In this view, biological evolution is not separate from cosmic evolution. It's an extension of the same quantum computation that gave rise to stars and galaxies. When we ponder our origins, we are the universe asking itself how it came to be. Our scientific inquiry, a part of its own self-investigation. The implications are profound and deeply moving. If the universe is a self-computing system, then we are not mere observers, but active participants in its computation. Our minds, our thoughts, our very existence may be the cosmos's most sophisticated expression, its way of becoming aware of its own nature. This idea, once confined to philosophy, is now entering the realm of testable science, thanks to quantum information theory. Mathematical models, like those from the IT from Qubit collaboration, show how space-time emerges from quantum codes. Other researchers have demonstrated how the universe's complexity arises from simple quantum laws, computed across vast scales. Even the no-boundary proposal, which posits that the universe emerged from quantum fluctuations without an external cause, aligns with this computational view. The cosmos, it seems, requires no external architect. Its own quantum processes are sufficient to bring everything into being. As quantum computing advances, humanity stands on the brink of a cosmic revelation. These machines, capable of speaking the universe's native language, may soon unlock secrets that have eluded us for centuries. They could reveal new constants of nature, hidden units of informational entropy that rewrite our understanding of black holes and space-time. They might simulate the universe's earliest moments, mapping the pre-space-time void where the seeds of reality were sown. And they could confirm that the universe is not just a collection of particles and forces, but a vast, self-executing computation it's every moment a step in an algorithm that began billions of years ago. This perspective transforms our place in the cosmos. We are not separate from the universe's computation, but an integral part of it, expressions of its ongoing quest to understand itself. As our quantum technologies evolve, we may be approaching a pivotal moment in cosmic history, a moment when the universe, through us, develops the tools to comprehend its own nature. The question, what built the universe may have a shockingly simple answer. The universe itself, computing its own existence through an infinite cascade of quantum information. This is not just a scientific discovery. It's a profound awakening, a realization that we are the cosmos contemplating its own existence, a universe alive with the spark of self-awareness. The journey to this understanding is far from over. Quantum computing is still in its infancy, yet each breakthrough brings us closer to decoding the universe's deepest secrets. Future systems may simulate entire universes, revealing how our own arose from the quantum void. They could uncover new physical constants, redefine our understanding of black holes, or even show how life and consciousness are woven into the cosmos's computational fabric. The possibilities are as vast as the universe itself each discovery a step toward a deeper connection with the reality we inhabit. This is a story of cosmic proportions, a tale of a universe that codes itself into being, of a humanity on the cusp of understanding its place within that grand computation. It's a narrative that challenges us to rethink everything, from the nature of reality to our role within it. The universe is not a distant, impersonal machine. It is a living, self-computing system, and we are its most profound expression, the means through which it ponders its own existence. As we push the boundaries of quantum technology, we are not just uncovering the universe's secrets, we are participating in its ongoing creation, a cosmic dance of information that began at the dawn of time and continues with every thought, every question, every moment of wonder.